Hey, good evening, everybody. Two coaches inducted into the Coastal Bend Coaches Association Hall of Honor tonight. I had the honor of being the MC for the annual event at the Holiday Inn Marina downtown. Brandon Schaff was also there and spoke with the coaches being honored and their families. Joins me now in studio. Hey there, Brandon. Yeah, good evening, Chris. One of the coaches who was honored tonight was Tim Holt. He was represented by his family since he passed away back in 2021. And the other was Veterans Memorial Assistant Coach Laney Wilson. Well, Holt, co Holt coached at Felfurious twice at George West and Gregory Portland and Mathis. So he was all over the Coastal Bend and was inducted posthumously into the Hall of Honor. His son Caleb spoke on his behalf and also played for his dad as a running back at George West back in the early 2010s. He says that that was a really special relationship. Great to see so many there thinking his dad deserves to be in the Hall of Honor. He just go over the top and give everything to his kids and give everything to everybody that he knows. Um, and, and that's just the kind of coach he was. He didn't coach to, to win games. He coached to mold men. So a lot of these guys are, I coached them 30 years ago. I mean, there's there's people here, you know, that are my kids, 15 years old, and there's people that are 70 here. And I know all of them, and all of them have had something to do with, uh, with me being honored. And Wilson, who was there with his sons, who also played for Vets Memorial, was also an assistant coach at Three Rivers and GP, spent some time in Round Rock and in the Valley at Harlingen South as a head coach as well. And he says that it's an honor for him to be inducted. It took many people working with him to achieve the success that he did during his coaching career. And the CBCA Coaches Clinic is also going on over the next three days at the Holiday Inn Marina. It'll see different speakers discussing coaching strategies.